parts of a historic church are coming down brick by brick. There are new signs of the aftermath of that strong quake that rocked the Napa area. KCRA 3's Kathy Park witnessing all of this right now. She joins us live from Vallejo to show us what's happening. Kathy? Well, Edie and Gulfs and crews were able to identify the problem pretty early on, and they were able to move in here pretty quickly. If you take a look behind me, the issue started way up above on top of this bell tower, and earlier this evening, we caught a glimpse of the preliminary repair work. At the corner of Sonoma Boulevard and Carolina Street in Vallejo, another casualty of Sunday's earthquake. I mean, it's literally being taken down brick by brick. The top wall of this bell tower at Force Baptist Church began coming down at dusk. We're planning on taking down all four sides of the tower, um, about three feet of it, the, the top part. That's the unsupported part that uh, has come loose from the rest of the structure. As the debris fell, crowds moved in for a glimpse. It's kind of, um, it's kind of not easy to like to see it now. For Austin Austyle, a small piece of history now left in rubble. I've been in that bell tower uh, once or twice. Uh, it's a really great memory for me to see this uh, going down. City officials say the majority of the retrofitted building withstood the test of the tremors, but remains red tagged. A structural engineer will be brought in tomorrow to take a closer look at the damage here in this building. Meantime, behind me, Sonoma Boulevard, it was closed for much of the day. We're told that it will be back open around midnight or until the debris behind me gets cleaned up. Reporting live from